At what age did you start wrestling, and who got you involved with wrestling? Uh, the age I started wrestling was about between seven, eight years old. We got into wrestling because my oldest brother uh, really got into it at the middle school and high school level and was doing pretty well. Um, we, I come from an area where the high school program is very good, um, Hop Hop High School, and we have a pretty good youth program. And me and my brothers, you know, we wanted this to do what my oldest brother was doing, and you know, we just fell in love with the sport at a young age, and you know, wound up uh, competing all the way through to college. When going through the recruiting process, how did you find out about Waynesburg? Waynesburg really was on my radar. Uh, actually, my brother Anthony, my twin brother, uh, he was looking at wrestling schools. Uh, when he came on his visit, uh, Coach Headley was in good contact with him. And then I just you know, came along pretty much because we were looking at schools in the general area around my older brother that uh, competed uh, in football, Robert Morris. So we wanted to be like, kind of close to him. And then when I came, I met with the football coaches. Obviously, I met Coach Headley. And, you know, just kind of fell in love with the school. You know, I really wasn't even thinking about wrestling when I came to college at first. Uh, once football season ended, they, you know, they needed like 97 pounders and heavyweights, which is around my weight class. Kind of walked onto the team, earned a starting spot, and just didn't look back. And it was probably the greatest decision, decision I ever made. What was your favorite memory with Coach Headley as a wrestler? It was my senior year. Uh, we were in a tight match, actually, with a pretty good OAC team, o OAC team uh, Heidelberg. And, uh, you know, we, we went into the match, I thought it was going to be a tight duel, and then Heidelberg actually had some forfeits. So we had a pretty big lead, but we weren't wrestling our best. Uh, so the match actually was coming down to 97 and heavyweight, and I was wrestling a pretty good kid who was ranked in the country. Um, and, you know, I ended up sealing the, the deal for the team. Uh, probably one of the biggest wins of my career, you know, being a ranked form and help, helping us beat a pretty good team. And uh, it's funny, I, like, I have a picture still of the match. My brother was coaching me because he was on staff at the time. And then Coach Headley was right next to him. They were like both yelling at me. So it's a great memory and it was a good team win. When moving from wrestling to coaching, was Coach Headley a big part of that decision? Um, and you know, kind of the job opportunity kind of fell into my lap because my brother was transitioning out to a job in New Jersey. And uh, it was kind of last minute. I was still in town, uh, you know, kind of figuring out my future. And Coach Headley reached out to me with a you know, great opportunity to, to still coach. And it, it was a great decision, you know, he's been a great mentor for me since day one. Um, he's helped me in so many ways now in the coaching ranks. Uh, I am such a, a better coach just from his guidance and leadership and his mentorship. And uh, I just hope I can do the same down the road for uh, the wrestlers and if any other coaches come through the program. What is your favorite memory with Coach Headley as a coach? It has to be the national title run back in 2018. Uh, when Jake won nationals, and he was the first Division III uh, national champion for a wrestling program, but also for the school, he was the first Division III national champion in any sport. And uh, it was a really exciting time. It really put Waynesburg University, you know, kind of on the map wrestling-wise, but as a school, you know, uh, you see stuff on social media of, uh, you know, how good we're doing wrestling-wise. And that was such an exciting moment. I mean, that video, obviously, you, know, you can see me uh, bear-hugging Coach Headley after the win. Is there any final words that you have for Coach Headley as he retires at the end of the year? Yeah, just, you know, I wish him all the best. Obviously, I know I'll be seeing him a lot still. We play pickleball all the time together. It's like something we picked up. Like, he started it. He was a gym teacher, and then he got me into it, and I love it. So we play all the time together and stuff, so I'm still seeing him, you know, with pickleball and golf. And, you know, just he's, you know, a lifelong friend, and uh, I treat him like family. I just wish him the best. He's, uh, he's put a lot of time into the sport. He's done so much for the sport from his high school days to his college days. And, uh, you know, I couldn't ask for a better mentor, a better friend. Uh, and, you know, I wouldn't be where I'm at in my life right now without Coach Headley. So I just wish him all the best. And I appreciate everything he's done for me.